Hello everyone out there, um, the people who watch me every day. Uh, actually, today I'm going to speak English. Uh, happy Sunday. So, I mean, the day is uh, almost over. But see, I have uh, this message on my heart uh, since uh, yesterday. And then I was not getting a chance to come here and speak with you guys regarding that. Yeah, actually... Um, I'm Shantan Hakiza, a mother of three children. Um, I'm married. I've been married for 14 years. I live in the U.S., Georgia. So I'm marriage consulting, relationship coach. Um, so that's what I do here on the social media. So uh, in general, I'm an influencer here on social media. Uh, today, I will come to speak to any couple who watch me right now. I would like to speak with men who's married, a uh, woman who's married right now, uh, special the young youth, uh, the young couple. Let's say young couple. Yes, young couple. So um, uh, actually, uh, also the people who've been together for a while, uh, I think this message is going to help you as well. So the other day, I was speak with the, um, the couple from... Uh, uh, one of the country uh, near of USA. So they've been here for like uh, 25 years. So it meaning they come here when there was a um, uh, young couple, so all those kind of things. But uh, they told me they live in a uh, back home for uh, 15 years married. And the, so they was arguing with something. So And they was asking me, so what do we should do? Uh, so at that time, they called me to the own store. Uh, I was going there and I was just like, okay, since I'm very, very busy, that's okay. I'll pass to your store and we could sit down and speak. So when I was talking to them, uh, the thing they were they've been arguing with and also they just need um, African uh, consulting, marriage consulting. So they were just like, oh, we don't need anybody from another country. We just need African because it is something we've been arguing with for a while. So uh, they told me um, most of the time, actually, they have uh, their own business. And the, most of the time, when they come from work, so the husband telling the wife, oh, you have to cook. So all of them, they've been at work. So, and then he don't want to help. So what they was asking me, I just like, oh, since is our culture, a woman is the one who have to cook. What is the ideas I could give to them to be helping them? Part two is coming. Okay, so if you marry, this is for you. So um, actually, this is the part two. Part two is coming. Um, actually, what they, they was telling me, they just like, okay, so. Uh, most of the time when you come from work, I am I am very tired. That's what the uh, wife was saying. Is. So I am very tired and also he's very tired as well. So, uh, but always he wanted me to cook. Always he wanted me to clean. Uh, he wanted me to cook. Uh, he just sit down right there and he's not helping with anything. So uh, right now I'm getting tired, but I can see we're getting old. Also, we need to be each other, like we need to help each other. Our children has been gone, so all of them that are already married. So we need our marriage to be success. So um, and it's just like uh, where the advice you could give it to us, so to be able to living together in peace. Uh, no one is could be nothing about them. So I was asking the husband, just like okay. That's okay. Are you ready for me to give you advice? And also you'll be able to do it. So they've been, they've been married for like 40 years. It's many years they've been together. So, but the most of the time, uh, the wife told me when they was back home, they was already having men, they already have it. So, I mean, and also when the children, they started growing, so the children are helping, so they always they cooked, and they also, she has not been in the kitchen, uh, but since all of them, 
uh, they had uh, three children. So all of them already get married. So she don't have anybody to help her in the kitchen. And she been asking the husband, you have to help me to cook in the kitchen. You have to help me to clean. So the husband be saying, no, 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 no. This is your job. You have to do this. So the advice I give it to them and also the people who watch me right now, who's married right now. So if you really, really love your wife, especially men, if you really, really love your wife, help your wife. I am very sure if you really, really, really love your wife, you're not going to let your wife to suffering by herself. You're not going to let your wife to cook by herself. You're not going to let your wife to do laundry by herself. So even the love you have for her is not going to let you to do that. That's what I tell everybody. Even people from where I'm from, I tell that them every day. I just like, if a husband really love you, he always there to help you. So that was really, really appreciated. So right now, the Tommy is standing now, they go to help each other. So the husband go to help the wife. When they come from the store, they get a home. One person go in the kitchen to cook. Another person started cleaning. So they're helping each other. So I told them, if you do that, you'll be fine in your marriage. May God bless you all. This one can help.